gonna shoot you right in the nuts if you're not careful. Oh, the frame rate's chug a bit. Oh, I was in the chest. Die, motherfucker! Jesus! All right, pistol time. Pistol time. Fuck reloading the rifle. Get your pistol out already. Fucking Jesus Christ! Killed bandit. Killed bandit. Oh, won't I ever use the rifle? The fucking peacemaker makes peace. G'day, guys. My name's Josh. You can call me Ja Woodle. And welcome back to Outlaws of the Old West, where I am standing in awe of my new homestead. I mean, look, it's only made out of logs, and it's still relatively new and a little bit empty, but whatever. This will serve me well going forward into the future of my journey as an outlaw cowboy. It's all very exciting. A little place of my own with my bed. I mean, I don't know, I have a bed. I said, it looks a a little bit dismal up here. In fact, I left my door open. So I'm gonna, I, I didn't even build a door. I didn't even build a door on my bedroom. I mean, it's, a, it's an upstairs bedroom. It needs a door. It's going to be let in the draft or something. Uh, we should probably do that first of all. In fact, where's my hammer? Can I do that straight away? I kind of want to. But I am back in Outlaws of the Old West because it is time for me to start doing the rustling, tussling goodness that makes me a cowboy. I need to go find something a bit more substantial than just building my house on the edge of a cliff. I need some planks. And that first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to sack up and go and fight those established cowboys I found over near the peninsula. I saw them, I shot myself, I ran away. It wasn't my proudest moment. So I'm here to redeem myself to try and pretend like I'm actually a real life human being and a man and can go out there and fight with the best of them. But before I do that, I need to make my door. I can't not have a door on my bedroom. That's just silly. That's ridiculous. That's like buzzards and shit in the desert. That's an awful idea. Put you there. There we go. That's going to work nicely. Now I can go out on my balcony and enjoy the view even more than I could before. My, I'm still sad I can't sit in my chair and smash chinnies looking at it there. That's, that's the whole point of the balcony. The view is there to be enjoyed, not to be like shuttered away behind a door and some windows. But whatever. The house is now well, basically done. I need, do I have my, I've got my, my canteen on me. I've got, do I have any, any food on me? I do have lots of food on me, actually. Never mind. Uh, I should probably leave some of this stuff at home. I don't need to take it with me before I go off and probably die. I can, I get one spawn out of my bed. I, if I, once I do that, I'm going to have to remake it, which is kind of annoying. I can't afford to make a an actual bed yet, given that I need hemp. And I have no idea where to find hemp. Maybe I'll find hemp up in the cowboy stash. Who knows? All of you guys, oh, I built a shovel. I forgot about that. Uh, everything here... Please, oh, I keep, I keep shift clicking. Shift clicking in every game ever is like auto stack. But this one, it's right clicks. So everything I don't need on me right now, please get in my chest. I'll come back for you later. Okay, I think I'm good. I've got 36 arrows on me, which isn't a whole lot, but it should be enough. It was three bandits there last time. So if I can take them on, it's like, what, 13? No, not even that. It's like 12 arrows each. 12 arrows to kill a dude. If I can kill a puma, or a mountain lion rather, and I can kill a bear, then surely I can kill some redneck Jeffrey sitting by his wagon around a fire. That's that's the plan. My plans never work out that well. But, I mean, who knows? We won't know until we try. Oh, hold on a second. What is that? That's... It looks bigger than the last mountain lion I fought, but it also doesn't look as big as a bear. So I'm not sure what you actually are, but I kind of think I should probably kill you. Uh, I don't want to get into a firefight and draw the attention of everything around when they start shooting their guns and then have some big, like, leopard Jeffrey come up behind me, jump on my back and start eating the back of my neck. That would be a... That would not be good for my survival chances given that I'm already nervous about dying as soon as I start trying to fight this guy. So, where are you? Can I get in a, like, a big, good position up here? There you are. Look at you. You're a big bastard. I'm gonna get, aim with this one because I feel like there's I'm a little there's a little bit better chance if I can aim like this. Uh, uh. No, nope, missed. Fuck, he's real big. Ah, uh. still big. Ah, uh. there we go. One. Uh oh. Oh, he's moving quick. He's moving real quick. Oh, he stopped. He stopped. Ah, uh. there. Damn it. Ah, uh. there. A headshot. Come on, Sean. I'm hitting him in the nose. That's gonna kill him. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. What a fucking shot that was. It was a mountain lion in the end after all that. It was just a really fucking big one. I'm surprised that I hit that shot on the run. I'm pretty proud of myself for that one. Uh, but he did just eat up a bunch of my arrows that I was saving for something bigger and scarier than old mate mountain lion here. Okay, give me some raw hide though. That's okay. Oh, all right. Well, let's... Uh, the night has fallen. I can sneak up in the darkness. Where the hell are they? Do they believe in a thing called love? Just li listen to the rhythm of their hearts. Well, this is where they were last time. They're, they're gone. I mean, well, I, could, I probably should have guessed, given that they are traveling bandits. They have a, like a wagon, a couple wagon and stuff to move around with. 
I don't know why I assumed they'd be in the same place. I'm going to scope out the rest of this peninsula, though, because I like it. I really like this place. If I have my time again, I'll definitely build out here. I mean, people were telling me that I should have built somewhere closer to wood and stuff. I, I like water and things. I haven't had, really had that issue where I am. The water's just over the hill, and I've got plenty of wood. Uh, it just takes a little bit of time to get it, is all. Oh, fucking son of a bitch! <laughs> no, 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 bear, bear, no, bear, I'm not here to fight you. I'm sorry I murdered, murdered your cousin. Ow, oh, Barry, please, don't do this to me. Don't do me like that, you big black fuck. Holy shit, that scared the fuck out of me. Yeah, that's what you get for sneaking up on me like that, you big black bear fuck. Holy shit, my heart is pounding right now. Can you fuck? Yeah, look, this, you try and be all t uh, intimidating and shit. I don't give a stuff. You've been outsmarted by a small boulder. Oh, your last boy got turned into a bed. You, I'm going to wear on my head. You are now my new hat. That's how fucking like little you are. You're my fucking headdress. Whew. Just calm down, get everything back to a resting heart rate, breathing properly, not like pounding through my chest will be a okay. I can't believe how fast that bear came from. He came bolting around this like obelisk thing at a million miles an hour and just like latched onto my face and clawed off my nose. I was not expecting it whatsoever. I probably should have like in fairness like expected a bear to be here. This is like peak bear environment, but I was so distracted by looking for the bandits that I didn't even give that a second thought. And I almost paid the ultimate prize for it. I was looking for people and instead I almost got murdered by a floor rug. I searched the whole peninsula and I found nothing. Well, I almost found my death and I found a bunch of fangs that are still like lodged into my face. Uh, but I didn't find anything I was looking for. I didn't find the bandits, so I don't know where they're going to be. I need to find them though so I can kill them and take all their guns and take all their loot and take all their good stuff. Because apparently that's the easiest way to get guns and I was too much of a shit shit to actually fight them last time so i wasted my opportunity now i see to find where they are now we, we can keep looking though it's still night time it's a balmy 27 and a half degrees out here right now i mean that's that's fucking atrociously hot for five o'clock in the morning but whatever we're in the old monument park we're in the wild wild west and we're enjoying ourselves just gonna you know, find some people to kill we can't be true gunslingers or in this case a bow slinger oh, sorry, we can't be true gunslingers until we actually have a gun whoa holy shit that's awesome you can see like the rain coming down and stuff. That that is a seriously cool storm. That's awesome. I haven't seen that before. I mean, the, the lightning strikes and shit, like the actual like rain column in the distance. That is sick. I love that it's like instead of just having like everything is now a storm, it's like this is the pocket of a storm. This is the Culo Nimbus dick bag making everything burst on fire in the ground. That is I haven't seen it before, and I fucking froth it. That's wicked. Man, every time I come and play this game, every time I, I'm here and just like fucking around and looking for something to do, something happens and it makes me fall even deeper in love with this game. I'm already pretty deep in, but at this point, I mean, just, I just want to play this all the time. Look at that! That's so fucking cool! And there's a delay between the thunder and the lightning. Man, everything's in this. Whoa, Jesus. There's dust devils and shit in this as well? That's, that's so cool. I need to stop gushing about this game. Apparently, they've thought everything through and everything here is really freaking awesome. Oh, now it's gone. There's no sooner had it started that it was gone again. That's so cool. Man, I just, can I just like be in this game from now on? Can I just play nothing but this game forever? Can this be the new Seven Days to Die? I will happily play a hundred episodes worth of this game immediately. This is fucking awesome. As much as I enjoy the game giving me this like showcase of all the cool things it has in it, like the thunderstorms and the whirlies and all that kind of stuff, you know what I'd love for it to show me again? Some bandits. I've been running for a long time. My house is over there somewhere, back down south. I've just been running in like, a couple of directions, actually. I hope I can find my way home. As long as I'm near this lake, I can usually figure it out. Look, there's there's a peninsula all the way over there. But I've been running for so long, I just want to find what I'm looking for. Oh, I'm all alone. There's no one here beside me. Is that a cave? That's a very pointy rock. It looks like there's a cave in it, like right at the tip of the arrow, right there. That... I want to go investigate that. If I can't find bandits, the best I can do is hope to find... I mean, it's probably a bear cave, and I'd not be, I'm not a big fan of bears. They kind of they sneak up on me out of nowhere and jump on my face. But I mean... <gasps> what the fuck? There's a Jeffrey. Jeffrey's got a gun. Is there more than that, Jeffrey? There's a, oh, there's a wolf down there as well. Okay, I don't want to deal with a wolf, but I do want to deal with you. Oh, interesting. Are you hunting something? You look like you're hunting something, or you're hunting me. Either way, you're all by yourself, and I want what you've got, and what- Ooh, there's a, a, a puff of smoke over there. 
Are you in a gunfight? What is happening? Oh, fuck it. I'm going to stalk him. This is my new This is my new game. I'm going to stalk him through the Wild West. Ow, don't break your legs, Jeff. Damn, it broke him a little bit. Or maybe I should just run up and just shoot him in the face with the bow. I don't know. Oh, there's a little bunny there. You shooting bunnies? What's going on? I don't know. Fuck it. Being brave. Being brave and or dumb. Easy. Oh, oh, he sees me, I think. Ow! Yeah, he definitely saw me. Nope, missed. Ow, is bad. Oh, God. Josh, learn how to shoot. One, two, three. Just come on. Keep going. Their aim is better than I thought it was going to be. Duck and weave. TNT Bandit is dead. Give me your fucking gun, motherfucker. Rifle ammo. You didn't even give me a fucking gun. After that, I caught two bullets in the chest. I didn't even get a rifle out of it. Damn it, I don't want TNT, I want a rifle! I'm annoyed at that. How did that rifle disappear? I had it, it was in my hands! I had it, I held it! Oh, but now, now it's gone. He was just a TNT, dude. He gave him some six of dynamite, which is, well, I mean, it's probably very helpful, but to me, right now, kind of useless. I'd love a gun. I can't go into this cave over here and just lob some TNT down there. That's a really good way to destroy whatever's good for me in the bottom of that cave. Uh, to avoid the wolf down there and keep moving across. Keep an eye out for any more Jeffreys running around. What was that? Is, is he, did he just go insane and just run off into the desert by himself? Why was there one random dude by himself traipsing through the wilderness? It's uh, not what you'd expect as someone like, who's been living in the wilderness for a while to do unless they've actually just lost their marbles. That's a big boy bison right there. I'm not going to fuck with you. I ain't fucking with you. I'm going to go off to this cave instead. A bison aggressive... I hope they're not- I wouldn't think they'd be aggressive. They're herbivores. They're not, I mean, they might be territorial. They might come and, like, stick their tiny little antlers into me, but... Oh, it's a bit, a bit less- uh, a bit less jagged than I thought it was going to be. And there's no cave. I came all this way for fucking nothing. I mean, sure, I got the TNT bandit, but, like... There's got to be more, right? There's, there's got to be more dudes out here. There's got to be. Well, now I've learned how to fight. Just, like, you know, just stay aiming down the sides. You can't... You can't just, like, hip-fire the bow. Like, I can't fire like this. I have to aim. Which is a little bit unfortunate because it means I can't, like, dodge and weave as easily. But uh, whatever. You know, I will, I will learn. I will make do. I want a rifle. One of the best things about this game is the render distance. Like, if you look all the way out there, just on top of that tree, right next to the arrowhead there, that's a bison. Like, you get, there's another one just there, too. Like, there's bison all the way out on that cliff over there that you can see. It's rendering that far away. Uh, anything else around? There's something there. It looks like a horse. We'll keep going around. Anything more? There's something there as well, but what I can't see is any bandits. There's no bandits out here. Even with this fantastic render distance, I can't see any people. I've been working for ages. I've been walking for so long. I've gone from the desert to like the lush, like uh, greener pastures, and soon I'll be in like an actual forest. Look, there's the forest just up this hill. I've been going for ages and ages and ages, and all I want is a gun. Oh, this is like the Great Western Journey, but with less firearms. That shit. What is this thing? So, oh, it's a beaver. <gasps> Wait, I'm uh, sorry, beaver. I'm sorry, but I need you. I need you because you need me to make a hat. Uh, you make beavers into hats. It's called a beaver skin hat for a reason. So, sorry, beaver. What are you doing all the way out here, by the way? There's no rivers. There's no dams. You're just, like, out in the middle of the wilderness right here. I'm sorry. Ooh. Ooh, is it, look, look at that. I love that. Wait, is that, like... That's, like, right over my house. I hope my house doesn't burn down from a lightning strike. If that happens, I'll be pretty upset myself. But I love how big this world is. I love that there could be a thunderstorm in a part of the world that I'm not. And I can just watch it from the hill. Oh, man. I just... <gasps> oh, there's like four of them! Run away! This one here is all by himself. He's left his friends behind. So I'm hoping I can get a little bit of distance between them and maybe pick him off. I'm going to stalk him. I'm stalking through the reeds on top of the hill. The, I have the higher ground. If Obi-Wan Kenobi taught me anything, then unless you are him, this is the plot. Damn it, they're all caught up to each other again. Okay, he's stuck on the rock. Oh, man, they came out of nowhere. I was just, like, looking out, fantasizing about the freaking storm out in the distance over there, wondering if my house is still standing. And then they almost snuck up on me. They almost got me. You know what? Can I... Oh, they... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is, um... Just stay quiet. Stay quiet. Hopefully they won't see me. They saw me. They saw me. Never mind. Open fire. Right in the gut. Go, I'll kill them all. I'll kill them all with my bow. There's so many of them. I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble, Jeffries. If I stay up here, they won't shoot me. Oh, I got caught it right in the fucking head. Oh, yes. Okay, one dead. Wait, where's... I can't see through the smoke. Can you get some smokeless powder, please? That's ridiculous. They don't seem to be able to figure out how uh, to get me on top of this rock. They're like a bear. I'm going to stay right here and just keep peppering them right in the face. There we go. There we go. As the... Wait. <gasps> I'm out of ammo. Right, guys. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Can you just wait there for one second? Uh, craft like 20 arrows. Because I just really quickly need to craft some more ammo. Oh! Oh! Shit! Ow! Come right in the face. No, 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 no. Like this. Not like this. Shoot him faster. Come on, you fucking dickbag. There we go. Ah! 
Oh, what a fucking shot! Woo! Oh, okay, that was exhilarating. Now, one of you dickbags, give me a fucking pistol. Got some, got some gold bars. <gasps> I got a pistol! Holy shit, they had so many gold bars. And who the shit did you just rob? Is there a stagecoach out here somewhere that you just, like, you just massacred and took everything from them? Oh, that was intense. I took down four Jefferies with a fucking bow. And it's also negative one degrees up here. I'm wearing nothing but my pajamas. I need to go back to the desert where I'm at home again. Oh, okay. That was a successful mission. Not only... Ooh, what's this? An eye patch? Cover up a bad eye. Well, I have two bad eyes. So what do you suggest for that one? I have a... The Evan. A lever action repeating rifle. Fucking... Oh, delicious. I also have two revolvers. Two peacemakers. Oh, that's glorious. I have so much wood, so much stone, all my tools. You know what? I call that a successful journey. My Wild West adventure has finally given me some fruits of my labor. It is time to do the fucking ridiculous journey back home all the way down there. Oh, no, the game just crashed. Oh, no, the game just crashed. Don't do this to me. Oh, please tell me you're going to save my progress because if you don't, I'm going to throw you out the fucking window. Okay, we're back. We still have, I still have all my guns. I'm still a million miles away from home. Uh, it's loaded me into the middle of the day instead of coming into night time. So my temperature is going, it's still at like one degree actually at 2.30 p.m. in the afternoon. So it's lost its mind a bit about like the time and the weather and all that kind of stuff. But that's okay. I can deal with that. I just, oh, no, no, I take it back. It's just shot up. It's now 20 degrees and rising very quickly. Well, that's kind of helpful then. So rather than getting frozen to death out in the wilderness, it just crashed and has set me back up in a pretty good spot. So let's go home, make sure my house didn't burn down to that last thunderstorm when the bandits showed up. Oh, wait, is there a correlation between bandits and thunderstorms? The TNT bandits showed up after the thunderstorm. Those guys showed up at a thunderstorm. Hmm, interesting. Maybe the thunderstorms do mean the bandits are coming. Someone told me it doesn't. Maybe it does. Is this hemp? Is that... <gasps> yes, it is! I finally found some hemp! I was just thinking, I'm that far north and out of, like, my normal biome where I actually live. I should probably think to find some hemp while I'm here, because this might be where it is. And there was one, like, right next to me. Oh, thank God. I've been looking for hemp for so long, and now I just need some more. There's no more around. Man, hemp is, like, super important. You need the hemp to be able to make, like, the uh, make canvas and to be able to make lassos. So with the hemp, I can make the canvas. With the canvas, I can make my bed. And with a bed, I can have my respawn point set and not just for a single time. So I don't have to worry about it when a bear drops out of nowhere onto my face. It's like the American version of a drop bear, but, like, slightly less dangerous. Oh, there's a guy right there. It's a solitary guy hiding in that tree. This seems like a perfect opportunity to test out my brand new rifle. Where are you? Come on, buddy. Oh, get, get your rifle out. Where? There we go. Okay. Easy. Easy. Now crouch. Mate, wait for him to stop. Wait for him to stop. Make sure of your shot, Josh. That'll do. Oh, <laughs> I missed it. As soon as I tried to make sure of the shot, I shanked it. Come on, buddy. Come, come to me. Come to me. Easy. Easy. Wait for it. Damn it. Missed it. Oh god, the, oh, the frame rate of is really doing me no favors. There we go. One, two, shot him in the gut. He shot him. Oh, damn it, missed the shot. Ow, don't die now. Come on, surely. How many times have I to shoot you? I've shot you like 14 times in the chest. Oh, all right. Well, that was a bad first experience with using guns. I probably should have just stuck with the bow. We've had a look at the rifle. What does the pistol look like while I'm on the journey home? I'm saying in like in the greener area to hopefully find some more hemp. I've got a bunch of hemp already. You get like a big stack each time you find a plant. I mean, the, the, the revolver, so you can't you can't see if you're trying to move with it because the, the hammer gets in the way of the front sight, but that's okay. So I'm going to keep my, um, my pistol on me because I feel like that's more of an oh shit pistol kind of thing. The rifle, like you saw, the hardest part about the rifle wasn't the fact that he was shooting me or that he was moving so much. It's just that like the frame rate, like, you know, a couple of meters out from me is just a little bit jumpy. So it's hard, it was hard for me to kind of pick where he was going to go. Oh no, I'm out of the green. I need to go back to the green to get some more green. I need to find them hemp bushes for 22, please. But uh, yeah, so the rifle, hard to kind of aim with, but reasonable okay. Surprising to do more damage though. It still took a bunch of shots to kill him. I'm finally back to the lake, but you can see how far I still have to go. I went a... I, I thought I could see... Is that smoke? Or is it, oh, is it, maybe it's just the cliff with some water. I, I don't know. It looked like there was smoke coming from the peninsula. But you can see how far I had to go to find some bandits and some hemp to actually like, you know, start with the next phase of my life as a cowboy. In fact, I'm about to leave the green area. Is there any more hemp around? 
Doesn't look like it. I do have... I've got 105 hemp on me. I can get high for the rest of my uh, Wild West life if I really want to. But I need that shit to make some stuff with. So I should have enough there to kind of get to the next phase. Oh, look at Dust Devil. Hey, Whirly Dirly. How you doing? Oh, get in there. <laughs> huh? Oh. I was far less excited than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to give me like a little ride. Maybe like I could have like, thrown me into the water over here. Like a sweet like water slide. Like a water dust devil. Oh, it wasn't to be though. My hopes and dreams are always ruined by reality. I just realized as well, there's a little notch in my morality bar now. Whereas before it was, uh, it was like completely empty. But now there's a little notch uh, on morality. So I'm not sure... Is that to do with like killing killing bandits and stuff? Like, do I lose morality if I shoot first? Or do I gain morality if they shoot first? Like how... Does that work? Someone who actually knows, please let me know so I can understand some of the mechanics of this game a little bit better. I, I, I just enjoy, you know, the building and the hunting and the looking for resources, that kind of stuff. Like, this game is just making me happy just by playing it without actually understanding everything. And that's the sign of a potentially really, really good game. I hope the development for this continues on as it has been. I mean, this is still only early access. It's still very early days for it. But this could turn into, like, my new favorite game ever. This could overtake everything else and I could just only play this. Build, like, McMansions in the Old West on the cliffs and do all that kind of stuff that I do in other games. Oh. 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 Someone didn't do a very good park job, but there's a fire. And if there's a fire, there might be bandits. I'm about to lose some morality. There he is. I'm about to lose some morality because I'm about to fuck some shit up. There appears to be only one. He's really, really hasn't done a very good job in the park, has he? Is that, um... Mate, I don't think you're getting your wagon out of there, if I was to be honest. Alright, so he's by himself. I'm by myself. There should be a fair fight where I can get the first shot in right on his noggin. Easy, easy. Every, every little touch of the mouse changes it. Oh, that was so anticlimactic. Oh, I pulled the trigger and it went... That was not the, the, the reaction I wanted to it. Alright, here we go. There we go. Oh! Oh, a second guy just spawned. That's alright, though. Never missed it. Missed it. There we go. Got him again. I was in the knee. I shot him in the knee. He's out there somewhere in the smoke. Mate, you need to put both the pistols down. I'm gonna shoot you right in the nuts if you look careful. Oh, the frame rate's chugging a bit. Oh, I was in the chest. Die, motherfucker! Jesus! Alright, pistol time. Pistol time. Fuck reloading the rifle. Get your pistol out already. Fucking Jesus Christ. Killed Bandit. Killed Bandit. Oh, won't I ever use the rifle? The fucking peacemaker makes peace! Received money. Oh, like, they had a bouncy on them? Fuck yeah, I mean, I don't have any... Wait, where's, where, where's my money? Do I, do I, oh, I have 56 dollar dues, but I have 26 gold bars. I mean, come on, 26 dollar, I mean, I guess it's the old west, so the dollar's worth a whole lot, but I've got so much money in my pockets right now. All right, is there anything good over here? Um, this probably isn't the best one to figure out, like, where the, like, the lootable stuff in a bandit camp is. It's probably going to be inside, maybe the, the other guy was inside the ground, that's why I couldn't see him. Um, can I loot anything here? Or is this just all, is it all fucked up because he's parked on the side of a cliff? Huh? Nope, can't go in that box, but this one. Uh, damn it, get up there. I want to get on top of the wagon and see if there's anything inside. Try it again. Uh, oh, yep, there we go. Nope, nothing here. Look at my little feetsies. I like how after all of that, look, there's my house right there. And the bandit, uh, the bandit camp I just raided was just here. Like, after running like, a million miles north, all around everywhere, trying to find places, there's the, the, the bandit wagon. And there is my house. I could have found one that quickly, but instead, I'd had to go... Oh, it's so far away. It's all right, though. This is still a super successful Wild West adventure. I got gold bullion. I got two rifles, two pistols, and just generally had a great time. I found some hemp. My life has improved significantly by my adventurous spirit. But can I... Can I dual-wield pistols? Is that a thing? Can I... Can, no, I, why Why not? Dude, why, you got two of them. One of those bandit douchebags is dual wielding. Surely you can dual wield too. Ah, oh, home sweet home. It is good to be home. The other good thing about my Wild West adventure... Oh, all my torches are on now. It sounds like my house is completely on fire, but it's just the torches. It's okay. Uh, the, good thing about my, uh, the other good thing about the Wild West adventure is I got so, so much wood. Like, an insane amount of wood. Look at that. I've got, uh, one, two, three, four, I've got 500 wood and a bunch of stone on me as well. Uh, so my, my axe is almost dead. Every tree I went past up in the green area, I cut down. So now I have all the wood I need for future renovations to my homestead. I can build it out to the side of the cliff and build some extra things to it. It's going to be a rip-roaring good time. The first thing I need to do, though, I'll put these nine random woods just in there and put some the steak. No, uh, the steak in there, please. There we go. Uh, ignite. Okay, you are good to go. I need to, like, can I make weapons racks? Like, can I make, like, decorative mounts for my weapons? Is that a thing? 
Crafting. No, that's the wrong button. E to interact. There we go. Oh, still the wrong thing. What? I need- I want to use my bloody table saw. Why can't I use- Oh, I didn't use my table saw. I was just being dumb. Okay, where you go over here, I need you to make me a whole bunch- Wait, what does it take to make a bed? Is it this one? Bed, 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 bed. Where are you? It's a bunch of canvas. Um, am I going blind? Oh, there it is. It's right at the top. Okay, bed. Um, four canvas, 15 ropes, 15 planks. I can do that with ease. Let's just make me- uh, that's not the wrong one. Canvas, that one, yeah? Canvas. Make me... Let's make me... Uh, I'm not sure, actually. Let's, let's just go 10 canvas to start with. Uh, lasso takes 10. I didn't even need... I thought I needed hemp for a lasso. Ah, damn it. Ah, for the ball's sake. Alright, that's alright, though. It doesn't matter. Oh, rope bundle. That's interesting. Oh, we're doing okay, though. Of all things that could have gone wrong there, not a lot did. We're doing reasonably okay. I've got my 15 planks, but I'm building a whole bunch more. I used 200 wood to make as much planks as I could out of that. I think it was like 50 planks. Uh, because with my better hammer that I have here, you can actually build stuff with planks rather than out of logs. Rather than having a log cabin, I can have, you know, like proper stuff. Like, like well, I can have foundations. That's fine. That's already had that. But like actual proper like wooden walls, not just like log walls. I like my wood cabin, but eventually I'm going to have to upgrade to something bigger, better, and sexier uh, later on down the track. So I've got my, I've got my canvas, I've got my logs, I've got my ropes. I think I've got everything I'm going to need. Press E to interact. Build me a bed. Uh, build. There we go. Double click. 20 seconds to build a bed. That's going to be lovely. It means I can start thinking about getting rid of the old canvas sleeping bag up here. Uh, can I just pick you up? Pick up. Pick up. There we go. So when I go on an adventure, I can take that with me. But for when I'm home in my mansion, well, not really a mansion is, but I'm home in my homestead, I can have my actual proper bed. Close the door. Close that door. Are you done yet? Yes, you are. Take all. And we're going to place you right upstairs, right at the head of the, of the floor. Uh, that one. There we go. Well, it's not really, um, huh, not really that, uh, that, uh, special, is it? It's not really that luxurious. It's a little bit, a little bit how you go, but that's okay. I'm going to put you right under the window frame. Boom, right there. Look at that. You can open the window, look out to see if any dickbags are coming to raid. But more importantly, you can have a lovely little kip. All right, so with that, I think we're just about done for this episode. That was uh, going to be a bit of a long one, but I know you guys don't really hate my, the longer episodes. It's fine by me. It's just, uh, it takes a long time to record them, as you can probably imagine. But that was a very successful Wild West adventure. I love my little house. I lo I'm, I'm excited to upgrade it. I'm excited to do some renovations and do some cool things with it. But, like, I'm, I'm just in love with this game. I love my house. I love the guns. I love the animals. I love the world. I love everything that's about it. Plus, I love that I'm going to be able to build all these extra cool crafting stations, which is only going to make things better and better and better for me. But I'll have to make things better and better and better for me in another episode. Because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like to make the like button down below or subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.